Here's your Storm Track 7 forecast. Good Thursday morning. I'm Storm Track 7 meteorologist Brandon Libby. We have a very high fire risk for today and tomorrow. Please avoid any burning outdoors. We have a lot of burn bans in effect already, so you just don't want to do it. Uh, but we have very dry conditions out there. Of course, it's hardly rained this month or last month. And then, of course, as temperatures warm up today, we're going to have very low relative humidity and some very strong winds gusting up to 35 miles per hour from the south. So there's a red flag warning in effect for most of the viewing area. That just means that the fire risk is critical. So be careful even like with cigarette butts or anything that could spark a fire. Um, otherwise, uh, we will be seeing the winds get warming things up. Highs will get back to near 70 today. Gusts will be around 35 miles per hour throughout the afternoon. And then still a pretty strong wind throughout tonight and tomorrow. It'll back off a little bit, but gusts will still be about 25 to 30. All these winds coming in from the south, that's the warmer direction. So that's why we're warming up. Most of today actually will be in the 60s, 170 on the board. That's going to be for Waterloo. But as the winds remain breezy tonight, we have lows in the 40s. Wind chills, however, may be down to the 30s. By the way, a lot of sunshine today, clear skies for tonight. And we'll have sunshine basically taking us in throughout the weekend. The temperatures is about the low to mid 70s there by Saturday. And then we'll peak on Sunday. Highs are near 80 degrees, about 20 degrees above normal. And then from there, we back off a little bit temperature wise, but we stay above normal and mild all of next week. It's essentially dry, just one minor chance for rain right now on Tuesday.